Turner County, Georgia, two officers prepare to lay down stop sticks as a pursuit barrels toward them from neighboring Crisp County. I'm at the county line, South Final. But the suspect spots them and shoots up the exit ramp, dodging the trap. The officers scramble to join the pursuit. Station be advised he's out on the exit ramp. The suspect was spotted not wearing his safety belt. Now he's topping 90, and officers struggle to keep up. It up. He's it up even more. He's about 90 but another set of stop sticks laid down by Sheriff Donnie Sellers does its work. He lost it. He lost it. The suspect's tire shreds, and he loses control. The officers follow his trail across the median. Oncoming traffic grinds to a halt. One 18-wheeler can barely stop in time. There's nothing left of the van but a smoldering wreck. The suspect hits the median too fast and loses control. The back end slingshots around, rolling the van over. The force of the impact throws the driver completely out of the vehicle. Sheriff Sellers hurries to check the suspect's condition as other officers call for assistance. 1080, get some help started. Medics arrive soon after and the suspect is taken to the hospital, hovering between life and death. His only crime was driving without a seatbelt, a $100 fine at most. But this devastating accident broke his neck and left him paralyzed. It's a price he'll have to pay for the rest of his life.